I found that nothing in life is worthwhile unless you take risks. Nothing. Nelson Mandela said, there is no passion to be found playing small and settling for a life that's less than the one you're capable of living. I'm sure people have told you to make sure you have something to fall back on. Make sure you got something to fall back on, honey. But I never understood that concept, having something to fall back on. If I'm going to fall, I don't want to fall back on anything except my faith. I want to fall forward. I figure at least this way I'll see what I'm going to hit. Fall forward. Reggie Jackson struck out 2,600 times in his career, the most in the history of baseball. But you don't hear about the strikeouts. People remember the home runs. Fall forward. Thomas Edison conducted 1,000 failed experiments. Did you know that? I didn't know that. Because the 1,001st was the light bulb. Fall forward. Every failed experiment is one step closer to success. You've got to take risks. You will fail at some point in your life. Accept it. You will lose. You will embarrass yourself. You will suck at something. There's no doubt about it. I'm telling you, embrace it because it's inevitable. And I should know. In the acting business, you fail all the time. Early on in my career, I auditioned for a part in a Broadway musical. Perfect role for me, I thought, except for the fact that I can't sing. I didn't get the job. But here's the thing. I didn't quit. I didn't fall back. I walked out of there to prepare for the next audition and the next audition and the next audition. I prayed. I prayed. And I prayed. But I continued to fail and fail and fail. But it didn't matter because you know what? There's an old saying. You hang around the barbershop long enough, sooner or later you're going to get a haircut. So you will catch a break, and I did catch a break. Last year, I did a play called Fences on Broadway. Won the Tony Award, but here's the kicker. It was at the Court Theater. It was at the same theater that I failed that first audition 30 years prior. If you don't fail, you're not even trying. To get something you never had, you have to do something you never did. Let's remember this. So you got to get out there. You got to give it everything you got, whether it's your time, your, your, your talent, your prayers, or your treasures. The question is, what are you going to do with what you have? I'm not talking about how much you have. Some of you have money. Some of you have patience. Some of you have kindness. Some of you have love. Some of you have the gift of long-suffering, whatever it is, whatever your gift is. What are you going to do with what you have? Taking risk is not just about going for a job. It's also about knowing what you know and what you don't know. It's about being open to people and to ideas. To not only take risks, but to be open to life, to accept new views, and to be open to new opinions. While it may be frightening, it will also be rewarding. Because the chances you take, the people you meet, the people you love, the faith that you have, that's what's going to define you. Never be discouraged. Never hold back. Give everything you got. And when you fall throughout life, remember this. Fall forward. Kim